Hey everybody, back again. Uh, you might hear something in the background that's rain, but I want to take you a walk about and show you. I never realized this until a little while ago when I started gathering hats, covers, hoods, etc., etc., from the World Camo Collection, and again. It's getting a bit out of control. And I'll show you what I mean. Bam! Bam! Bam, bam! Um. There's. Boonie hats, 43 caps, Shamas, officer's caps, or NCO cap, NCO cover, work hats, boonie hats. Cappy hats, stretchy hats, you name it. Luftwaffe hats, multicam, East German hats. <whistles> Tell me, guys, uh, is this something that should be tackled individually or in um, sections? More boonie hats. More 43 caps. Dovetail swallow. A dovetail hat, berets, overseas caps, more boonie hats, more patrol caps. Holy shit, boss! I was going to play Metallica to this, but it tends to. This camera has a shitty mic, so. Well, that's the cat's meow, I guess. Falshi Mager helmet. Reproduction, of course. I can't afford $4,000 for a real one. But that's a damn fine reproduction. I gotta give them that. And, uh... Well, there it is. The Paul O. Hat. Crazy. H-A-K Jason. Sportsman guy lover. This is like the material you're talking about that that uniform you that jacket you just bought. It's the ripstop nylon. This is actually from Canada. <laughs> yep, there's the label. Hat Boonie, 100% ripstop cotton. Highlander Scotland Limited. Oh, it's from Scotland. Well, I'll be damned. I got me a Scottish boonie hat from Canada. Hmm. All right, well, you guys tell me. What do you want to see? I got it all. I mean, you want to see just 43 caps? You want to see... I only have a few officers caps, you see them. But boonie hats, I mean, this is Arvin from Vietnam. This is the real deal, Daddy-O. This ain't no garbage reproduction. Um, you know, Marpat. Portuguese, man. I got fucking more Marpat. This is the ex solely made. More Marpat. ACU, which is garbage. Fake Marpat. Hmm. Potato pattern. Of course, is reproduction Miltech. <clears throat> These are my t poor 43 caps that were my work hats. I wore this 43 cap. Every day to work with a SS skull and an eagle on the side. I wore this hat to work for 12 years, and this is what happened to it. It literally disintegrated. And the reason it did across the top is where my respirator would strap would go across from my mask because I painted and did FAA repairs when I um, wore this hat. But, I mean, look at that thing. Is that used and abused or what? If it wasn't double-lined, it would have been gone a long time ago. Actually, it's triple-lined because it has a liner in here, too. And then this one was its replacement. This one didn't last that long. This was a Butto Tool Splinter A pattern. Reversed to white. Yeah, ain't white no longer, is it? This is what a real war one would look like. But, uh, again, it had the SS skull 
no eagle on this hat and uh, yeah it's been through the mill so that's just my two work hats that I put through hell this one only lasted like I said three or four years and then it had to be the way of the dodo the original moleskin one right here this one was a tough bastard and it was actually dated at one point it had a tag in it from like 1977 or something but it's gone I have, an, I have an, a really nice one this is a, a herringbone twill see the material there see the V's in it I know you can see it I can see it this is a very early West German uh, hair fucking hat and somebody has made it bigger by cutting it and putting this piece of material in there see it and it is clearly dated I mean hold on I'll get you in good light all right hold on hold on I can get you here there we go wait right here it says 1958 Bamberger Munson Industry 1958 uh, October the 13th 1958 and is a size 55 and it is in great shape great shape so that's actually probably my oldest 43 cap that's real from the Bundeswehr or the German Army and this one is kept away in a nice safe place so alright that's just teasing you guys a little bit so you guys gotta let me know what do you want to say you know come on it's your call got all this stuff here what do you want to see you tell me and I'll make the video alright guys uh, have a good night and God bless